and welcome back everybody to Let's Play Final Fantasy Tactics. When last we left off, I was doing some grinding and I said I was going to finish it off camera. I did. Um, I did everything other than learn my abilities. Uh, basically, a lot of what I did job... For the most part, it was job point grinding, um, but I'm level 24, exactly. Um, and Samurai has 999, so I can learn two hands. And then I am going to swap off of Samurai again. I'm going to go back to being a Lancer, because it's my favorite Final Fantasy job. Just for anybody who didn't know that, actually, I will admit to it right now. Anybody who knows me is going to be surprised and think that it was either the Summoner or the Black Mage. Those are definitely my close second, and they kind of tie for second. But I think the Lancer is my favorite Final Fantasy job. Like, I always, whenever I can, I basically always have a Lancer in my team. Just pretty much, like, always. So, I would kind of probably be lying if I said it, didn't say it was my favorite. Um, I am going to do two hands. Um, which I think is going to cause him to, yeah, two hand the Partisan. Um, I believe that will increase his damage by a lot, I think. It doesn't really say, like, 11 attack power, 9, yeah, 11 weapon power, 9 attack, but if I go two hands, still 11 power, 9 attack, but I'm assuming it will just hit harder. Um, he also has the Wizard Mantle equipped again for some reason instead of Diamond Armlet. I don't know why. Just does. Let's see. His abilities are going to be the more complicated ones to figure out what I'm going to do with. He got 643. So that's enough for what? Four abilities? Yeah, four abilities. So I got to figure out what I even want. So Hell Ivy works on grasslands, thickets, water plants, and ivy. It can stop the enemy. That works on gravel, stone floors, stone walls, mud walls, and tombstone, and it can petrify. Rocky cliffs and lava, lava rocks. Books, trees, bricks, bridge, furniture, iron plate, moss coffin. Wooden floors, rugs, boxes, stairs, and desert, and deck. Okay. Swamp marsh... Poison Marsh, so that's the Marsh one. That's the Sand one. Duh, Sandstorm. Snow and Ice, so that's your Snow and Icy area. Roof and Sky and Chimney. That actually might be more helpful than you'd think. Lava and Machine. Okay, so I think Hell Ivy comes up a lot. Grassland, Thicket, Water Plant, Ivy. That's a lot. Um, natural Surface, Wasteland, and Road. Waterway, River... So I'm gonna get Hell Ivy. That'll probably happen a lot. I feel like Carve... I feel like this'll happen a lot because of, like, gravel and, like, stone floors and stuff like that. So I feel like that one will come up a lot. Bridges. Iron Plates. That one's weird. The bridges would happen a good amount. Wooden Floors... Stairs. Well, Pitfall's got to be like the most... It's natural surface. So like, whatever that is. Um, I'm thinking Demon Fire. That's, that's the one I'm thinking. It's Demon Fire. Like... I mean, I guess whenever there's water, like rivers or lakes or sea or waterfall or a waterway, any water you can use water element, and it could frog them with water ball. Matter of fact, we are just gonna get the first four. Just straight, just get the first four. Um, I think he's actually gonna stay a Geomancer for a while. I don't, I don't feel like switching him out. Now that I have the Geomancy abilities, I kind of want to, you know, have him actually be a Geomancer and actually put them to use. It'd be nice if he could equip a Holy Miter, but I don't have an extra one, so you know how that goes. Um, I also don't really have any money spent it on potions. Lots of potions. 
Wow, you have a lot. You can learn how to use through elixirs if I wanted you to, but I don't. That's the spoiler alert there. High ethers restore 50 MP, but I know I don't have a, as many of those. Um, I want to do just an ether. Auto potion's really, really tempting. But I want to get like eye, eye drops and echo grass in case I may ever get silenced. Softs would be nice to have. So I want to do all that. Um, I know it goes against my better judgment, but she's actually going to probably stay a chemist. Um, I mean, I guess for now, I have potion, high potion, X potion, ether. All I really need is throw item. So once she has throw item, I'm going to take her off of being a chemist. Um... But I'm thinking I might take gain job points off of her and go back to equipping swords and go back to holy sword. Um, yeah. Just because I think that for now I'm not as worried about that. Um, Oracle actually seems really good. There's a trick with spell absorb you can do. Um, if you have another mage in your team and your mage is out of MP and you're running out of MP on your Oracle, you can start spell absorbing from your mage, and whether or not your mage has that much MP that you absorb, you will always be able to drain MP from them. So if you have an M a mage that's completely out of MP and there's nothing you can do to fix that, you can actually just keep spell absorbing from them to use them as an, M an infinite MP source, which I find kind of interesting. Um, I want to do Confusion Song. That would be really good, but I'm not getting it right now. Uh, sleep? Just a general sleep spell? Foxbird lowers brave level, which I don't know how helpful that is. But I do want silence. So I have all the basic status effects. Uh, summoner, yeah. So when she hits people with her stick, she gets like 40 some odd job points. So she has almost 1400 because all she had to do was sit there and hit people with her stick. And so she just stood behind the oracle and just kept smacking and never stopped. So yeah, she has a lot of job points and I'm actually really tempted to get her half of MP. And just roll with it. But I'm not because I wanted to get Leviathan. So I'm gonna get Leviathan. And then I'm going to be tempted to get the silence summon. Because if I could silence a large group of magic users. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Save it. Save it. Um. And for now, I'll switch back to wizard. And set summon magic. Uh, wizard land, you just gotta get to your threes. Um, okay. I think everybody's set and ready to go. Used all their job points. Anybody who I did want to change what they're on, I think I already did. Except for maybe her. She maybe doesn't need to be an oracle right now. Um, I could get the ability to pray faith, the pray faith spell. Berserk. Petrify. I just want to go back to being a priest. Because she does only have cure 2. She could really do with cure 3. At the very least. Yeah, I'm gonna switch I'm gonna switch her back. Even though I just bought her the, the rod. I'm gonna switch her back to a priest, because I want her to gain cure three, at the very least. There goes this, this silly game again, being like, oh, you don't need the white robe, do ya? Yeah, actually that's fine. You can use the healing staff. You can beat your, your friends with a stick. 
that'll work. Oh, it did it over here as well. Wait, weird. All right. I think now everybody's good to go, except for that he has a green beret. Can I finagle? Because I could sell the muskrod. It's not very much though. They don't even have them, so never mind. Oh, well, probably have them right here. Yeah, they've got the black codes right here. Unless I wanted to go with Twist Headband, because it does give him the physical attack power. Or does the Holy Miter actually give... give Does give magic plus one. That actually might be a good idea for him, then. But I'd have to figure out how to... How to have enough money for it? I mean, I could I could sell the brigandine. I'm I am using power sleeves now. And this gold armor, I could sell one of those. There we go. That'll do it. Oh no no. Okay. Fitting room. You. It says black hood, but that's just because it wants to give me the thing that gives me the most health. I am thinking I'm going to go with the Holy Miter just because that gives him the extra magic power. Um, and I think that matters for his abilities. Also, I don't know if I found out or not in out, like in game or, or in recording or if that was when I wasn't in recording. But uh, the draw out of the... Um... The sword that I have, the Masamune, the one that heals, it's actually pretty good. Um, so don't fight at Gronk Hill, please, because I actually want to do some content tonight. Thank you. If I had fought at Grog Hill, it would have been the last thing I got to do tonight, so... <laughs> I wanted to make some actual progress instead of just grinding and grinding and grinding. He's only level 22, but that's okay. Agrius is 23. Chanel's also only 22, so, you know, these things happen. Luna in the back corner, having just hit 23. So Ramza is a full level ahead of Luna, which I feel like wasn't true back in the day, but it is now. Ramza did a pretty good job of demonstrating how Yell can make him go way too commonly. You know what you're saying? You're the one who doesn't. We're not tools. Tools for murder. If we stay there, we'll be used as tools till we die. Come on, Malik. Let's escape together. Who helped us when we were lo when we lost our parents in the war? If Grand, if Grand Duke hadn't saved us, we'd have starved. He cared about us. Now you're returning the favor with vengeance. You've been deceived. Baratine took advantage of the war and burned the village. Why? To get the family skills only our family knows. He burned a village to get my heaven skill and your hell skill. He killed our parents! Don't you see? That's ridiculous. You know what he did! What he did to me! I know you know! Don't say any more. Otherwise, I... So here you are, Malik. He'll be here soon. I know. It's all set. Malik. Here he comes! Heretic Ramza! Rafa! Help! Oh, no. Well then don't do anything dumb! How about that, okay? Hey, sweetie girl. How are you doing, sweetie pie? What you doing over there? You need something? Yeah. Ow! Don't throw a ice ball at her. Like a literal ball of ice. Are you throwing shurikens at her? I haven't got to do anything about this yet. She's just getting screwed. Watch her just like run through the door and go to fight. 
I'm an idiot. Nope, nope, she's using a potion. 30. Please move out of the way. Thank you. She's a heaven knight. He's a hell knight. You! You're that man! You're supposed to be waiting at Weir Riovane's castle! That was what Grand Duke said! I'll prove we can beat you without the Shrine Knights! Okay. Good luck with that. Whee! <laughs> I love this. I love being a, a freaking. I just love it so much. It's so freaking great. Alright, so I do have what I need to hit that area with Geomancy. So that's good. Let's move a little bit closer. Because Geomancers are also good fighters. It's one of the reasons why I wanted as my other character to be a Geomancer here. I can get both of them. And I can just do it. It just happens right now. Carve model. 42. 48. It doesn't do a ton of damage, but it always has that chance for a status effect, and the status effects that they deal with it are nasty. So, it's like petrify and stop, and it's I, like some of them are just like sleep and simple stuff like that, but tons of the more common ones are not that simple. They're like really mean. Leviathan. Space, space strength back. What? <laughs> I'd only get one of them with it. And it's not in a place where anybody's gonna walk into it, so... I could set up a fairy. Or I could do a reflect on us. I don't know that you can reflect ninja balls. And I can't reflect that anyways. Yeah, I'm just gonna wait. You can't reflect summons anyways, so... Oh, I didn't get my oracle magic! Oh! Oh well. I can do this with just my white. supposed to have my oracle magic. That's okay, though. Oh boy. Oh boy. It, what, what is going on? Oh god. Oh god. What is going on? Oh god! Silent Light, shield from evil. Shell! That sounds like a good idea, whatever that was. Although I'm, I'm literally gonna fall on his head here in a second and he's gonna have a very bad time. Ow! Bye, Geomancer. Glad I put up that shell, cause... Oh, he did not die from that. Damn, I hate retreating like this. Oh. Okay, well, he did. It did do less damage than it prescribed, though. Ow! God, these ninjas throwing their stupid balls. God! Alright. They all 
all get to go if I do that. They all get to go no matter what, basically. I wonder if I shouldn't just do a fairy, but... I'm gonna throw a titan at him. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna move over here and throw a titan right there. Eat that. Flames gather and destroy Azura. Oh, I see. They're like random. They do like a random number of hits in a cross. Yeah, I can't get through. That's a lot of damage. This is gonna really hurt. Let's try getting her up. Get Agrius out of there. Cast a raise on him. Get me, get her out of there. I wonder if you just walked into my Titan. Because that would be pretty freaking great, but I'm pretty sure you did. Don't hit the Geomancer. Damn it, I just raised him. Oh, he's still alive. Cool. That just went off in one turn. I hate summoners. They are so very, very OP. What? Why don't I get to go? Why do I not get to go? I didn't get a turn. These guys are all, like, way faster than I am. It's weird. I'm probably in their range from here. Ugh, one turn raise. I kind of wanted it to be longer than that, but that's okay. I mean, I guess one turn gives her the maximum amount of time to maybe get to do something out of it. Instead of just getting demolished by another summon. That, that basically kills my whole team. But I don't get to go, so... There's the other one. 
That's what I'm saying. Like, summoning is... This is why I have one. This happened the last time I went up against summoners, too. I don't know how to handle this. I don't know that I can. Because even, like, her dropping potions on me does me no good. I get a raise off, I raise someone, and then they immediately die to the next summon. They don't even get a turn, usually. Usually it's just instantly dead. There's a crystal for her to go get and get up to full health. Blink. Full MP. And then see, I didn't even get to go. He did not even get to go. Before he's getting just destroyed by these fucking magic- Rafa's getting a second turn! What is up with my speed? Am are my people just actually that slow? And like, if so, why? I'm not low level. I don't understand why I don't even get a turn. Like, you would think I'd get at least one. I just- my people need at least a turn. One turn! To do anything. All I'm getting is my mages. I don't get a turn with anyone else. And now they're gonna get their turn again. I mean, I guess eventually they're gonna run out of MP. But then they'll just be crystals, and they'll just get to do their crystal crap. Oh my god, I get a turn. To die. Okay, walk up next to you. Because I have nothing that takes one turn. Fire's happening. I can't stop it. It's on me, so... Like I said, I have nothing that takes a turn. Except just to whack you with a stick. So I guess that's what I'll do. And make you eat the fire. Okay, they're coming out. So if I get a turn here, thank you. Four hundred and seven. Go away. God, I've had enough of you. Bring him back. I'm not sure if my holy swords would be able to kill the summoner or not, so I don't really want to risk it. And I also, Agrius is the only thing keeping the team alive. Her ability to just stay back as a chemist is the only reason we're still even moving. So... I could cure him. I only get 77 back though. I'd rather just raise the mage. Ugh. <sighs> Still got enough MP to just Shiva us and kill us all. Yep, there it is. I can get out of it, so that's a plus. And I will, because fuck that jazz. Okay, I can Moogle before it goes off. Whatever it is, I can Moogle before. It's Shiva, it's seven turns away. If I do a fairy, if I do anything... If I do anything other than Moogle, it goes off after it. Okay, 
so I will Moogle, just in order to try and keep everybody else alive here. Hey, puppy. Yeah, I'm having a- I'm having a tough one. This is a tough fight! That's- that's the- you don't need to- you don't need to say hi to everybody. They- they know you're here. They do. If I go right here, I can stab her in the face and probably end this fight. Yeah. Stop it. Go away. Are you alright? Yes, thank you. I... I... If they return, we're in trouble. Let's hide. Holy crap, that fight. Summoners are not okay. I should not have jumped on him, I should have just jumped on the summoners. The ninjas weren't okay either, just continuously able to throw those freaking balls and do all that damage with those. Ugh. It was not, that was not yummy. Barrington only wants one thing. To be the king. They call him Weapon King for making strong weapons and training many wizards. There's one who incites the Grand Duke that is of the royal family. Killian Larg and Gultana set the stage for him to become a regent. Why do you keep fighting being branded a heretic? I think I know why, but nobody will thank you for beating him. I'm not fighting for thanks. I'm fighting for honor and pride as a Beowulf. That's a lie. You aren't that noble. You can't ignore injustice or evil in front of you. You flatter me. I'm not that good. But what are you going to do? I must go to Rio Veins to save Alma. But you barely escaped from there, right? I must get my brother out. Why are you two fighting? One second, I apologize. Cutscene begins, and what happens? I sneeze. Ugh. We're 50 year war or orphans. I'll never forget those days looking through garbage and dead bodies for food. That's when Barrington saved us. I believed in God then. Barrington built orphanages for the war orphans, but. He provided training to gifted children to be professional assassins. You must be those children. We Galthanes have a secret skill of the family. My heaven skill and my brother's hell skill. These two skills differ from magic. Barrington wanted them, but the family elder refused him, so he burned the village. He decided if he couldn't have them, he'd erase them from this world. He probably was excited when he found us among the orphans. You tried to escape when you found out the truth. We yearned for him to be like our real father, but even then... So this is where you're hiding. Malik! Listen, Ramza. Hurry to Riovane's castle, or your sister will be dead. If you touch Alma, I'll show no mercy. Rafa, you're coming too. Resist and Ramza's sister will die because of you. It's not fair. They have nothing to do with us. This is not a warning. It's an order. Whoa! You blew up your frog messenger! Let's go, Ramza. Sorry, Rafa. You had to do this because of us. It's not your fault. Don't worry. Oh, uh, no! What a douche. So 
What's next is Yugua Woods and then to Rio Vane's Castle. Uh, but that is for next time. Because right now I am going to quit and go to bed, I actually think. So, yep. Yeah. Uh, it doesn't look like I've got any to use there. He barely got to do anything. He took a dirt nap for most of the fight. Agrius, however, was throwing potions like a crazy person in his ten short. My priest was raising a good amount, but didn't get enough for any for cure three, so. That's too bad. You did a good amount to save the team, but it wasn't enough to learn a three, so. Um, we have a whole bunch of chocobos that are not the ones I want. 97... 49.58, though. Eh, whatever. Get rid of the lower level one. You go somewhere else. Get out of here. Wow, you are all level 19. I don't know why I keep holding on to these monsters and letting them breed, but I do. Alright, so, when we come back, next story mission, Yugua Woods. And when it happens, it happens, I'll see you all then. Have a good- well, actually, hold on. I was about to be done, but then I realized I can shop here. What can I shop for? See, golden hairpins. They cancel silence and they give a ton of HP! Oh my god, they give a ton of MP too. That's 30 more. You lose a point of magic, but that's 30 more MP! That's like an extra two spells. Wow. Wow. Sprint shoes. Oh, a bracer. What does that do? Physical plus three! Wow! I want it! I want it in my life! Always reflect. Cancel silence and berserk. 108 gems. Cancels undead, bloodsuck, frog, and poison. Oh, and it does more. Strengthens fire, lightning, ice, wind, earth, water, holy, and dark. What? 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 <laughs> oh my. Dracula mantle. Things just got super real in the accessory land. Oh. That's really, 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 really good. Strengthens all the elements. Like, you give that to a mage and they are gonna... Oh. Yeah, if you give that to a mage, that's definitely better than magic plus two. You give that to them, they have the defense against that, and then if they're plus to magic from their other stuff, like, you know, their wizard rod, and maybe their holy miter, or if you still have it, or at the very least, their plus via their freaking black robe. That, the black robe strength is fire, and ice! I need that too. I need that. That I need right now. That we are going to just go over here and say try it on, and you are going to try on the black robe. It is less MP than the white robe, and it doesn't have the damage anymore. So she's gonna be more. Glass cannony again. But that doesn't matter because fire, lightning, and ice are all strengthened. So all the standard black magic is all gonna do more damage, which is great. Now, when it happens, it happens, and I'll see y'all then. Have a good one, everybody. Have a good one. <laughs>